I forgot to say this. This is so important to me, and I reacted this on Twitter. I actually quote retweeted it, but did you guys see that Kotoka is coming back on the 14th? Did you guys see that? She's coming back on the 14th. It was so insane to see. And the crazy thing to see about it was um, she's coming back on the 14th, but she she actually she told me and I think she was like Exy, nobody knows about this but I'm gonna tell you so I don't know I think it was just so sweet because we confided in each other like that that one one like one final time so I knew uh, a little bit beforehand that she was coming back on that date and I was so I'm just so proud of her. I'm so proud of her. I love her so much. And you know, I still feel very, very loved and appreciated in Ian that people would would tell me important things about their lives and, and other stuff like that. Like behind the scenes. It means so much to me that people feel like they, they can do that. I'm excited. I can't wait to see Kotoka Mead too. I can't wait to see her. It's been a while, but I'm happy that she's taking. She took the break that she need. She felt like she needed, no matter how long. I always say this. I've said this, but it's an important thing. We. It's going to be. It's sad right now, but as one door opens, one door closes, another opens. I. I remember calling management and saying that as well, and saying, I'm probably the most forthcoming and honest with management. Like not not in Ian. I'm just saying that. That's just my approach with them. I'm very honest and very, like, real with, with them. And I was like, literally, hey, this is... This uncoupling is due to me wanting to pursue a different kind of, like... Like, you know, different creative opportunities here. It's not because I, you know, uh, this or this or that reason or 